Welcome back to the show. My first guest tonight holds a special place in my heart. Almost four years ago, she delivered my daughter Audrey into this world, and then this past July, she worked her magic once again and delivered my son Owen. Please welcome Dr. Amber Cool. Oh, look at this. Oh, I'll give you a hug. Mm. This is where you can hug her too if you want. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Amber, have a seat here. Hi. Thank you for coming on absolutely. the show. We really appreciate it. I want to thank you publicly and everything. My kids are beautiful. They're great, all because of you. That you just had you, nothing you, to do with you me. ripped them out. You ripped Absolutely. them out. So tell me, how many babies have you delivered? Because what you do is just amazing. It's pretty fun. Probably about a thousand at this point. I think Audrey was maybe six twenty-four or something. Oh my goodness, a thousand <laughs> babies! And, 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 and just it, real quick, explain the whole process. You're like. You, it's go time. You're nice and sweet. And also, when it's go time, you're just ripping and going. And how does that work? Well, I hope I don't rip too much. Well, you don't rip that much. I mean, my wife might say something different, but exactly. but, <laughs> but just explain the process. I mean, how does that happen? You just get the call if they go into labor. So get there as fast as you can, depending on how fast they're going. Oh, um, but it's a, it's a fun job. If I have to work, it's what I love to do. Well, let me tell you something. You you showed up when Owen was born. It was like what four thirty, five o'clock in the morning, and we have some pictures of you. <laughs> right. This is let, let's let's show those real quick. This is what you wore to deliver our child, in which I think is amazing. There's my oh. wife Amy and and Owen. <laughs> Is that normally what you do? Is that how you wear? I was working that day and seeing patients. And <laughs> there, you, and there we are. <laughs> it looks like you're going to prom. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh. But you, is that a normal outfit for you? Well, yeah. I mean, I try to not wear scrubs and look sloppy no. all the time. But, no, you, you, know. you looked amazing. And my wife was really jealous. So. <laughs> well, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. How many men have been in the room? These manly men that also, when things start going, they start break down and cry. Oh, all the time. All the time. And yeah. I was fine, right? You were okay, yeah. You, yeah. you did very well. You were yeah. very well composed. Well, actually. Taking you, pictures, though. Taking yeah. Yeah, here and there. get that documented. But, you know, my wife still hates this. I actually asked you to be on the show while she was in the middle of, of labor. Yeah. Have you ever had that before? No, I can honestly say that that was a first. That was a first. Absolutely. Now, again, go through your routine because you just, you could be doing anything. What's, what's the most thing let me slow down i'm just so excited that you're here what's the most important thing that you were doing at one point and they called you and said hey you gotta come deliver a baby i'm sure you could probably use your imagination that oh really you're in the middle I'm of sure something that's yeah. happened once or twice i mean that's i have horrible. four kids oh so, so you're saying you do the math right is that what you're saying absolutely well Again, you, you moved your offices now, so you're not at St. Mary's anymore. You're nope. down on Peyton Street, right? right. Like in the new offices, everything yeah, going absolutely. well? Yeah, absolutely. No rickety-rackety old elevator, good parking, <laughs> good staff. Can you talk to Courtney for a second? Because she might be an expecting mom. We I don't know. know. Give her oh, some advice. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. <laughs> tell her I that know, parenting... I don't, even, I, don't even I don't have to know how many times I have to tell Jamie that I'm not pregnant. But well, just tell her. I need some business. So. Oh, really? So. <laughs> well, I am looking for a new doctor. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. It's That's promotional cool. for me, this visit That's here. horrible. <laughs> All right, let's do something real quick. Let's play a little true or false. Okay. I want to read you a question, you just answer by true or false. You ready? Okay. Okay, true or false. If you're having a difficult time getting your child to sleep at night, it is best to put them in the car and run the engine while the car is still in the garage. But make sure the windows are down so the good smelling fumes get into the car. Is that true or false? I'm thinking that's false. That's false? Oh, okay. Yeah. False, Courtney. Don't do that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Benadryl. All right. <laughs> Benadryl. Down and down. Let's get another one here. True or false? The most enjoyable time a new parent can have with their child is bath time. Plus, the tub is a great babysitter if you need to answer the door, do dishes, watch a movie. Plus, the bathtub is a great time to teach their little ones to play by themselves or possibly learn how to swim. Is that That's true? That's a tough one. I think that one's probably false. Too. That one's false. Yeah. And how about this one? I've been thinking about this. What I normally do is when my child's crying, I usually put them in the closet, but you're always supposed to leave the light on when you close the door. <laughs> Absolutely. Right? <laughs> Yeah. It's, it's always that's, safe. What, that's how we practice parenting in our house. Well, I just can we have you do something because I know you're very skilled and talented. Okay. Patrick, can Patrick come on out real quick? <laughs> yeah, Patrick, he, he's our stage manager. Is Would he you pregnant mind? Too? No, he's not pregnant. <laughs> okay. Would you mind circumcising a banana for us? <laughs> sure. Yeah. Come on over, Absolutely. Patrick. Come on over. Let's. Here we go. I don't know if I have all the right tools. No, no, and everything's sterile. Okay, and if you fantastic. mess up on the banana, you can try Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. 
Oh, uh, okay. Let's measure it out a little bit here, about okay. a centimeter or a two. Centimeter. That's, that's and perfect. I have different equipment, certainly. Okay. I don't do this all freehand. Okay. Just for any parents out there who have boys that I encounter. <laughs> all right. Um, so you probably want to do about a centimeter on a banana. We'll, we'll ah. do a little. <laughs> I do use some local anesthetic. Okay. So, you know, well, we need some for the office, Yeah, too. absolutely. So this is kind of... She's actually doing it. Yeah. This is legit. Yeah. She's actually circumcising a banana. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> And you're going to eat this later, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Just want to make sure it's nice and even. Yeah. Don't cut off the tip. <laughs> yeah. Don't want, oh, I'm going to move it just a little bit. There we go. There we go. Don't want to cut off the I am so amazed. This is what our show has come to. Amber circumcising a banana. Absolutely. There it is. Now, if yeah. I pull off the tip, this is not common or okay. standard practice. Okay. okay. Oh, and I did. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm, I'm so really sorry. sorry. Are you next? <laughs> no, I think. Okay, well. Take it from, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, take it from me. She knows what she's doing. Amber, thank you for coming you on so the show. You are so welcome. I'm your, sure they want just, the scalpel back. Yeah. Absolutely. Thank you very much. We'll be right so back after this. Thank you very much. Whoa. <laughs>